My name's Nigel Woodward and I'm Managing Director of Classic Motor Cars. Uh, we're based here in Bridge North and Shropshire. I'm uh, sitting in this uh, fantastic 1954 Jaguar D-Type. It's one of three cars that finished first, second and third uh, in the 1954 24-hour Le Mans race. It's one of many cars that we've restored here at uh, Classic Motor Cars. That's one of our sort of key activities, uh, the restoration of, of classic Jaguars and many, many other marks. We've got a truly 360 degree uh, classic car service. Our customers come from uh, all around the world. We're a truly uh, global business. Obviously plenty of the UK and European customers, but we also have customers in New Zealand, the United States and the Far East and the Middle East. Classic Motor Cars Limited has got a number of quite unique uh, aspects to it. First of all, we're an employee ownership trust. So around 70% of the business belongs to the trust and every member of the team here belongs to the trust. So a very similar model to John Lewis, for instance. Okay, one of the benefits that gives us, all of our staff have got a real buy into the business and, and a real interest in making sure that we provide the, you know, the very best service. Another sort of aspect to, uh, to our business is the fact that we're all on the one roof here. So we offer every conceivable service to the classic car owners. We have our own en engine shop, trim shop, paint shop, where we contract out very, very little. Everything is based here. This year is our uh, 25th anniversary. We were formed in uh, 1993. The uh, business that we're involved in, the re restoration and the maintenance of classic cars, requires uh, very highly skilled artisans and craftsmen and women and technicians in order to, to conduct that business. But in order to try and preserve the business for the future and in order to try and make sure that we can look after our customers moving forward, we've invested very heavily in the March's Centre for Manufacturing Technology. It is a public-private fund enterprise. It's funded currently to the tune of about four and a half million pounds. A percentage of that has been funded from the, the local authority and various associated organisations. Now the Marches Centre is based just next door to us here so that's at the Stanmore Industrial Estate in, in Bridge North. We are a key uh, partner. Apprentices are extremely important to us here at Classic Motor Cars. They are our future, they're the future of the business. We currently have three apprentices. They are uh, carrying out their apprenticeship at the Marches Centre. And their first project is to restore uh, a Lancia Aurelia, which they're making a, a, a fantastic job of, and I'm uh, looking forward to driving once they've finished it. Uh, we'll also be taking on another apprentice in September. Uh, that person will be based in our panel shop. We have a, a large panel facility here where we manufacture panels from scratch and indeed carry out repairs to uh, all makes and models of cars. Cars. The fact that we've got strategic resources as the Marches Centre for Manufacturing Technology helping us train our, our youngsters and our, our apprentices uh, is a tremendous help to us doing business here in Shropshire. The Midlands is uh, famous uh, for its connection with the motor industry. There are some strategic motor industry partners based here in Shropshire and in fact in, in Bridge North. Close to home, talking about the classic car market, uh, worth about £4.9 billion to the UK economy. We find that being based here in Shropshire yeah, offers us significant advantages. We're very pleased and happy to be working here in Bridgeton. Uh, Shropshire is a fantastic county to, for a business to be based in. I've actually only just moved into the area and it's been a fantastic experience for my family and myself to come up here and work, at, work in Shropshire. Absolutely beautiful county. Surprisingly, quite a lot of our strategic partners are also based here. So on this site, for instance, we have Granger & Wall, who are a renowned foundry company. Uh, they make lots of castings for the uh, Formula One industry. Indeed, we partner up with Granger & Wall in a number, of, uh, a number of areas. And there are lots of other strategic partnerships that we have within this area. Uh, there, there is a surprising amount of industry going on in Shropshire. We, uh, we, we find that uh, we have to outsource very little really outside, outside of the county. The local authority are also extremely helpful in my experience. I think Shropshire has a number of attractions for, for businesses, particularly when it comes to recruiting staff. It is just a lovely, lovely place to live and I think that's a big, you know, the quality of life is there for staff and I think that is a big draw when you're trying to recruit. Property prices are relatively low compared to maybe other areas, certainly in the south of England. There are major advantages of setting up and running a business in Shropshire.